uh, what's one of the biggest things you sort of try and teach in the lads coming up at coming up at your gym? <clears throat> Be honest with yourself. You know, um, you know, I think I see a lot of people that um, or a lot of kids or fighters that are just so driven by like, social media or how they want to look or you know what I mean. It's just so you get it and just like. It's, it's, it's strange, you know. Um, yeah, it's, social media is a massive thing with fighting because, you know, again, it's one of the difficulties of the sport. If you haven't got a following, then who the fuck are you, isn't it? But um, just, you've got to be honest with yourself and the reason why you're doing it, you know, if you want to do it, is it is it just for, to try and get likes or to try and do this? If it's to try and get fame, you know, you, it's, it's the wrong, um, it's the wrong sport to do it, you know, it's a, uh, it's ruthless, and it, uh, if you're not doing it for the right reason, you'll get hurt. Um, but then, a lot of these people who just post up and they're not really fighters. And, yeah, you know what I mean. To be honest with yourself, like when you, you, know, when, you, like, when, you speak, when you speak to your coach and or you speak to somebody, and you know you lie into yourself and you lie into them. You know, like oh, oh, I want to fight. I don't want to fight. Oh, I'm injured. I'm too injured. I can't train. I couldn't make it. I'll try and be there. There's no try, is there? Is mm. there? Oh, as, as Yoda said, isn't it? <laughs> it's, it's do or don't do, there is no try. You're the Yoda of your gym, yeah. <laughs> well, I just think some people are calling me some other things now, but uh, <laughs> yeah, you know what I mean? Just be honest with yourself. Like, if you've, if you've had enough of it, then stop. If you're, not, if you're not enjoying it, you know, if you're going through stuff, talk to someone, you know, it's yeah. be honest with yourself. And it's, um, you know, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's definitely a sport you've got to be in 100% like that. Yeah, isn't it? Can't sort of half have your foot in. Yeah, no, I think you always need to have. Um, it pissed me off, like McGregor said it, like, well, you don't have a beat. I don't have a, a plan B because my A's so good or whatever. It's like, but then that's fair. But then he's one in a million, you know, so many fighters are working, uh, just to, working just to pay bills and then, you know, they're going to the gym all night, you know, just, you, you've got to have, you know, boy, these guys should be going to, uh, doing university and stuff like that, you know, um, yeah, you know, they should have an idea of where they want to go after it, because it's not, um, it's, um, it's a small window, you know, and if you don't make it, you know, fair enough, you can only do it once in your life, as in, you know, you're never going to be young again, so go, go uh, flat out, but, you know, if that's the case, you need people to support you. Um, and it's not often the case. Um, but yeah, <laughs> it's only one way to do it. Man. Yeah, they feel like because McGregor as well, a lot of maybe a lot of maybe more casual fans think it's an easy way to like make a lot of, make a lot of money. Just you know, turn up, knock knock a few people out, and before you know it, you're making millions. Yeah, well, you know, he's he's a lot higher paid. He probably gets paid more than fucking. The entire like, UFC roster, you know, yeah. like obviously on the weekend it was a UFC card. You know, his one fight probably cost more than all of theirs. You know, it's uh, it's um, again with the pays is um, you know, it'll look it'll get looked at someday. You know, and, um, you'll still see some uh, uh, grievances there. You know, <laughs> you know somebody's earning money, but uh, yeah, whatever. It is. It's the sport. <laughs> you can't you know, me barely eating. Going to change football. 